Lots of cheers going on at Boeing Field today. This is where the 777X touched down after its very first flight. After being nearly a year behind schedule and two days of weather delays, Boeing's new 777X finally took off from Everett today. Our aviation specialist Glenn Farley has more on a happy day for the company and its employees after a pretty tough year. With the snow covered Olympic Mountains visible in the distance and little wind compared with the 30 mile per hour gusts of yesterday, Boeing's 777X, the future of one of its biggest planes, found a hole of blue sky to take to the air. But the delay had its benefits. Uh, finals <laughs> yesterday. Ooh, finals. Yep. Lucas Birch is in high school. The delay saved, yep. So glad it got delayed. <laughs> Thinking seriously about an aviation career. Oh, it's awesome. It's so cool to kind of witness history in the getting to see it take off for the first time. I mean, that was really cool. But this has got to be a piece of good news after a pretty tough year, isn't it? It actually is. It's very interesting to see something like this fly finally after hearing about it for years. Jerry Miller's wife works on the 777X, and he's right about the years. In 2013, the legislature and governor extended billions in tax breaks on commercial aircraft manufacturing to keep other states from stealing away this next generation of one of the company's most successful jets. Boeing investing more than a billion in a brand new factory in Everett to build the lightweight and longer wings out of composites. Wings where the outer 12 feet actually bend up. After nearly four hours, it emerges from the clouds. The jet touching down at Boeing Field. A moment of celebration. <laughs> Captain Craig Bombin was in command. How did it feel? It was awesome. We had so much fun. We would still be flying if we could be, but it was so much fun. I, honestly, the airplane was solid. We had a nice trip around Mount Rainier. Captain Van Shaney. It, it is really emotional because, you know, all the employees, all the work they put into this airplane. Next step, certification with the FAA, and then the first delivery to an airline now scheduled for some time in 2021. At Boeing Field, Glenn Farley, King 5 News. So four airplanes will be part of this flight test program. Meanwhile, production of the plane has already begun.